Philadelphia Cheese Steak and Food Festival. The Cheese Steak and Food Festival is another large gathering promotional event that Imagine Lifestyles participates in. While we're there, we interact with the guests. We try to meet with some of the other merchants that are there, see if we can establish some other business-to-business -business relationships that we can use in the future. And this is a great opportunity for us to work directly with the local radio stations that put on this event. This event worked out a little bit different than most of our promotional events do. I actually didn't go this morning for the setup of our area, which I normally would have done. Instead, Javier and Cynthia have already taken care of all of that for us. So when we get there, all we have to do is look pretty and talk to people. I just talked to Javier. He told me that the event's already opening up. People are already coming in. Basically, I'm late. We're gonna see if we can sneak in through one of the gates on the back side of the event anyway. Also, traffic. Cool car. So while we're at the Cheesesteak Festival, one of the things that I always like to do is I try to go around and I talk to other people that are here. You never know what kind of connections you're gonna be able to make and sometimes they're really beneficial. So one of the relationships that I've made recently is uh, with Staff Sergeant McKenna here from the U.S. Army Recruiting Department. And Sergeant McKenna, what is it that you guys do at an event like this? Uh, we get out here try to reach out to the community. Uh, just trying to change some of the stigmas that the community and the locals have about the Army. Try to look for new recruits to come in that want to better themselves in college, uh, have the Army and the Army Reserves pay for college, and just somebody get out there and get some adventure in their lives. So you guys get some pretty cool toys to bring out. I see we got like an inflatable basketball thing right here. You guys got the, uh, the cornhole games down here. Uh, what else do you guys get to do when you come out to these events? Uh, normally we like to bring our rock wall. We didn't have the, uh, the opportunity to bring it due to limited space this time, but we had the rock wall, so that's a very fun adventure. We like to see if everybody can actually climb up, uh, go a little bit higher than the next person or maybe their buddy. Um, and we just kind of bring most of our RPI, all of our gear, to show people kind of what we do, teach them about the jobs and everything that we do. I think we saw that rock wall at the last at Fantasy Fest, right? Yes, you did. Yeah, that's right. We got some video of that last time. Very cool. So it's definitely nice to meet you. I, I, I'd love to work with you guys again. You know, it's always nice to give back to my country. And I didn't serve myself, but it's a good way for us to, to try to help out, to try just to work with the Army when we can. I have an idea for something we might be able to do, like with maybe like with high school proms or something like that. Is that something you might be interested in? Yes, no doubt. Awesome. Definitely. All right, we'll talk soon. Thank you very much. Right, bye. Let's see who else we can find around here. There's a lot of people in this area, a lot going on. I'm sure we can find somebody else to talk to. So I did, I found somebody else. I'm here with Steve Platinum Tailgating. Steve, you've got like this really cool RV setup. What is it that you do with this thing? I set up for events. We entertain a lot of corporate parties. We do back, we did backyard parties, pool parties, you name it. Whatever you need, we can set you up and have an epic moment. And you're saying tailgating, if you go out to like football games, basketball games, and like do those tailgate parties too? We do everything. We do basketball. We do football, we do baseball, we can even do hockey. Wherever there's a parking lot, we can set up and set up an epic, epic event for you to come and have an enjoyable moment that you will never forget. Okay, all 
All right, now listen. I see. I see you got this big TV right here, right? All right. But can you get me like drinks or anything like that? Because if I'm hanging out and I'm watching TV, I'm about to see a game. Sometimes I get thirsty. We also have bartenders that we have for different events. We serve the liquor that you provide, and we have it on ice, chilled and ready to party when you get to the event. All right. What do you say? Maybe you and I put something together. We'll get a party going, maybe at my place or something. I'll bring the cars. Oh. You bring the drinks and the food, just, and then uh, and we'll you see just say the word. You just say the word. Some ladies for that, I think, right? You say the word. I'm there, brother. I already know where you're located. I love the cars. I love the vibe that you bring, and I think oh, I we can this. definitely do a good event together and it'll be memorable and then they'll be knocking on the door beg begging for more i love this i love this steve <laughs> thank you very much man it's been man. a pleasure pleasure me i will talk to you soon all right see man everywhere you go with these events you can find new people doing interesting things and you never know where that awesome connection is going to be i think this guy might have something special for us so as always plans change i came here in the corvette i'm going to be driving home in the truck and trailer my GoPro's dead, I can't film anything on the way back. I'm just working off the cell phone now. The event was great, I met some awesome people. Uh, Sergeant McKenna from the Army especially, and Steve from the tailgating trailers. Uh, and I think Steve and I are gonna be putting something together really soon actually, so I'm excited about that. That's gonna be really cool. Uh, so everybody, thank you for tuning in today. As always, I, just, I love doing these events, getting out here, working with the people. Uh, thank you for joining me, and until next time, remember, keep a full tank.